Hearty greetings. This is um, an update to the How to Get Classic Skype back little um, video snip that I did initially for my parents but put it up because um, it seemed to help a lot of my friends. It's March the 17th, 2018 and I've just noticed in um, a comment from somebody that looked at the video that Skype had taken away the possibility of downloading classic Skype from the Get Skype for Mac button here. So in the video I showed that you could actually click on it in this menu here and it would automatically start to download. It's no longer available there as you see. However, they've changed the wording in the little bit of text above the button. Uh, they've now got, as we continue improving the accessibility of Skype, we currently recommend voiceover users download Classic Skype. So there it is there and you can see it's clickable. So rather than it being down here in the blue button menu, as was in the main video, you now click on this little section here. And when you click it, it automatically sent the little download up to here and it will download from there. Now I recommend that once it's downloaded you put it in an archive somewhere to store it in case it, um, it is not available again in the future and for some reason you actually end up um, having the new version of Skype installed by the system itself. Just remember to do as the main video says uh, by going into Skype preferences. I'll just get rid of that and make sure that you untick the always keep Skype up to date button there. And that will ensure, hopefully, that uh, the system will not update Skype for you automatically. Hope that helps, and um, I'll sign off now.